All right, so tonight was the December 5th edition of Monday Night Raw. Overall, I thought this was a solid episode of Monday Night Raw for the most part. But before we get into this Raw review, first things first, make sure you subscribe to the channel, man. We're about 10, 9 subs away, I believe, from the big 2K. I can't believe it that we're almost that close to 2,000 subscribers. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Also, like to the channel, share the video if you can. Tomorrow, I will be dropping my NXT deadline uh, preview and predictions as that pay-per-view, NXT's next pay-per-view, will be taking place this Saturday. But uh, let's go ahead and get into the Raw review like you've been watching. So, we actually kicked the show off with the Usos defending their undisputed tag team titles against the interesting team of Matt Riddle and Kevin Owens and basically how this team even came together was they the Usos attacked um, <laughs> Matt Riddle's partner Elias backstage so Matt Riddle needed a partner Kevin Owens was like hey I got no problem with the bro and honestly I thought this was a pretty good opener between both teams here but um, after the match Shola Sequoia pretty much destroyed Riddle so much to the point that they had to put him in the ambulance. And um, I don't know what this means for Riddle. Maybe this means he's going to AEW. <laughs> nah, I'm just joking about that. But no, no jokes aside, um, looks like they're going to write Riddle off for quite some time, which is probably good because there's really nothing for him to do creative-wise as of right now. I mean, his own tag team partner, Randy Orton, is still out. Hopefully he's getting better. And um Yeah. We see a face-to-face -face confrontation between Becky Lynch and Bayley, which obviously leads to the triple threat number one contenders match, uh, Rhea Ripley versus Bayley versus Asuka. I thought this match was um, pretty solid between these three women here. Um, uh, you know, Bayley getting the win, I feel like, made sense because Rhea, uh, yes, they're going to do her and Bianca, but like that's going to be like later down the line, like probably around Mania. So it, it made sense as to why... Um, Bailey won this match, let alone Rhea didn't get pinned, you know what I'm saying? Now, Seth Rollins cut a pretty good promo, and basically this led to him and um, Bobby coming out, because I believe him and Bobby Lashley will be facing for the United States Championship next week, and um, those two end up having some words, which actually leads to um, <laughs> one of the officials, I think it was Pete, PD who got taken out. Um, so I was like, uh-oh, uh-oh. One of the officials got taken out. Um, even um freaking Adam Pierce was like, bro, like what well, why'd you do that? You know what I'm saying? But um yeah, that, that was a pretty good segment from both guys there. Theory and Ali was for the US title. I thought this match was okay. Um poor Ali just taking still taking L's. Um, even after the match, freaking um, Ziggler came out and Ziggler and Ali were going at it. And then, of course, Theory attacked both guys. But Theory is still the United States Championship. So JBL has been doing this little poker stuff going on. I don't know what was going on here, but basically all this poker stuff led to um, the OC Alpha Academy and taking on Baron Corbin in a six-man tag team match player with Shaw the OC actually get the win over Alpha Academy and Baron Corbin in what I personally thought was a pretty pretty solid match. Um, but definitely a win that the OC definitely needed, you know, especially coming off the heels of last week, losing to the Judgment Day. And um, I just thought the match was pretty solid. You know, you had Dominic Mysterio versus Akira Tozawa. I can't really give you a big rating because this match didn't really last long. But I'm not going to lie to you. I thought Dominic looked good here in, in the win. Um, getting the win over Tozawa. And then, of course, you saw the main event, Becky Lynch, Alexa Bliss, Nikki Cross, triple threat match, triple threat number one contenders match, where the winner will go on to face Bailey next week, where the winner of that match will go on to face Bianca for the title. And um, like I said, man, I just thought, well, I, I kind of felt like this was some, some solid stuff right here. And uh, kind of capped off, in my opinion, a pretty solid episode of Monday Night Raw, and Alexa Bliss actually wins, so Alexa Bliss and Bailey will face each other next week, um, so yeah, some solid stuff right there, should be interesting, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed my Raw review, um, again, remember to subscribe, like, and comment, 
This has been the kid DC wrestling. And so, um, yeah.